Good day and welcome. I was about to try and do a Scottish accent. I totally, I was, I'm already bailing out of that. Um, good day and welcome back to another Gas Walkthrough. Today we're looking at November 25th, 2025, Scottish Whispers by Clover. Clover's one of our sons here at Gas HQ, so my name is uh, Bill Murphy. Good day, how you doing? Um, pleasure to see you. I'm still wearing my like purple sunglasses on my head. Um, yeah. Uh, Oh, I should probably explain. Scottish whispers is not, not a thing in a true sense. Clover was like, ooh, hey, anyone who gives me a good suggestion of a nation and a whispers line, because uh, as we've done on the channel several times, there's a thing called German whispers. Anyone who gives me a really good suggestion of a line that I can use to puzzle, I'm going to do it. Um, and she was like, uh, and I believe, uh, Discord user Passman suggested Scottish Whispers, the Clover turned it into a puzzle. Um, I've been slacking because I was sick all of last week, um, so I have not tested this at all. This is a blind solve. Uh, I know, like, I know some people love it when I do a little bit of a blind solve every now and then. Um, but, yeah, this is, uh, gonna be interesting. Can't wait to see what happens. Um... You to see how my brain works when I'm solving something for the first time. But yes, we are gas. Genuinely approachable Sudoku would create a sense of genuinely approachable Sudoku for you, the person watching this. You will find the link to today's puzzle in the description down below. You will also find hat times. Two hats for a very fast time, one hat for a pretty fast time. Everyone gets a dinosaur because we love you weekly. Um, that being said, I'm going to jump into it now. Uh, so let's do it. This is Scottish Whispers. What does that mean? It means normal Sudoku rules apply. Each box... Each row, oi, oi, each row and each column must contain this one to nine. Now, we have some uh, three lines here, um, and each line contains only one distinct digit. So, nine, for example. Can't have nine, eight, because that is two distinct digits. So, it's like clones, uh, but like whisper lines. Cool. Um, uh, that is actually all you need to know to solve today's puzzle. Uh, that being said, I'm going to jump into it now. Let's do it. So, what is the first thing I noticed? So, I noticed this line, uh, which sees 7 and 8, meaning it can only be a 6 or a 9. But can I do better? I absolutely can. I've noticed this line, which sees 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and 8 um, in all three of those cells. And they all must have the same digit. That has to be a 9. Now, uh, via Sudoku, we can put 8 and 8, that one, and then 6 and 6, and this has to be a 7. Let's come down here and see if we can pull off the same trick. Uh, almost certainly not, um, because uh, this cell uh, just sees 9. Uh, can't, all right. The three... The three clued ones were giving me quite a bit of vibes. Uh, is there anything I can do with that? Uh, not particularly, which is very interesting. Uh, all right. Hmm, I don't know where to go. All right, let's take let's take a second. Let's always go back to your first principles about when you're. Uh, what am I saying? First? Uh, when you're solving. Uh, so you can go, oh, where do I have the most information? I'm going to say it's these triplicate lines. Um, and if I'm wrong, so be it. Uh, this can only be 6, 7, or 8. Uh, what can this be? This can only be 1, 3, or 5. But it can't be the 1, because we've got the 1 down box 9. What about this one? Uh, 1, 2, uh, 1, 3. Uh, that was not super helpful. But what it definitely does tell me is 2... Let's go here in this box. Uh, can uh, where two can go sort of there. Oh, yeah, yeah. Um, where does eight go? Uh, five. Five can't go there, so that's a five, and that's a. Five. Um. All right. Let's let's see. Do I know anything about it? Oh, great. Okay, so I do know that that's a nine. Um, because 9 can't go in either of those cells because of that one. Uh, this is now 6, 7, and 8, all this way. Uh, now, uh, 1, 3, 4, and 5. Oh, that's very interesting. So, uh, 
whatever this cell is has to be the same as this one. Uh, so two, six, seven, eight, nine, three, four, five means this actually has to be. Uh, now three, four, five left to place in this column. That's a four. This is a three, five pair. Um, eight and oh, still don't quite know enough. Uh, let's try this one. One, eight, nine, two, five, three, four, seven. That's cute. That's sixes. Um, oh, and then that clears six out of all of these cells, which puts six here, six here. Interesting. Uh, that leaves a naked single two up here. I don't think this is the uh, smoothest way to solve. One goes there, uh, seven, eight, nine along here, eight, nine, put a seven here. Uh, that's an eight. Hey, that's pretty good. Seven, seven, seven. Oh, this is, this is a, this is a little spicy one, Clara. I love this. Eight, uh, seven. All right. Oh, what a really useful deduction. Whatever that cell, whatever that digit is, can't go into any of those cells in that box. Ha ha ha. All right, uh, that's two, three, or five. Useful. Let's cut, let's go this way. Uh, one, three, four, and eight. Uh, oh, eight, one, three. So this is a four. Okay, so maybe I should have just been going around the outside. Um, see, oh, that's too hard. That's not a helpful trick. That's a one, three, because we have the eight in column two. So that's going to be an eight and an eight. Uh, six got to be there. Uh, and then, oh yeah, we're nearly done. Wait, we've got to be nearly done. That's a nine. Uh, this is a seven. Uh, one, three, four, one, two, three, four. Four. Uh, take the one and four out. Uh, this cannot be a one. Uh, this is a three or four. Uh, oh, I have a lot of digits. Okay, so, uh, what I've just noticed. I basically have most of the six, seven, eight, nines, but I just don't have them in. Uh, this is a six. There's eight. Go eight has to be there. Uh, two, three, five across the middle. Mm, that's a five though. Uh, one, three, four, nine, nine. Can't go there. So nine has to go there, and that one, four sees those two cells. So that's three. One, 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 three. Uh, four, four, take four out of here. Five, 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 three, uh, two, three or four here, but that's just, there's only one single left to place in that box. That's two, uh, one, four, ooh, three, five, two, and four. That was really good. I really, really like that. I definitely needed some thinking time, uh, but yeah um that was scottish whispers uh thank you so much for that clover that was really cool um that was scottish whispers by clover uh my name is bill murphy uh wherever you are in the world i hope you have an amazing rest of your day and i'll catch you bye yes